everyone welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video today's video we are going to be making a facial serum we're making a special facial serum this facial serum is rich in antioxidant antioxidant that will help to brighten lighten and also boost collagen and reduce wrinkles and fine lines in the skin this is a natural facial serum that you can actually whip up in your kitchen using natural simple ingredient so if you're looking for a facial serum that can help to transform Form your skin in a short space of time then why not follow me to my kitchen I'm gonna share the recipe with you and I'm also gonna share some tips and how to get the best result from using this on your skin for this recipe you're gonna need a small blender or a grinder now my first ingredient is rice and today I'm using white rice I'm using rice for its anti-aging properties. Rice will help to reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. It will help to boost the collagen production in the skin. Rice also help to tighten and firm the skin. When mixed with the other ingredients that I'm using today, this will create a complete, a powerful anti-aging booster for your skin, for younger looking skin, fresh looking skin, firm looking skin. So what I'm gonna do with this rice, I am gonna be blending. For this recipe, you can choose to use white rice, purple rice, or even some black rice. So reach for your blender and add about a quarter cup of the white rice to the blender. Once this is done, I'm gonna put this aside and prepare my other ingredient. My next ingredient is dried orange peel. You can choose to use orange peel, lemon peel, or even some lime peel for this recipe. We're using the citrus peel for its vitamin C properties. Vitamin C will have to boost collagen. It will have to clear pigmentation on the skin. I'm using about an ounce of the dried orange peel adding this to the blender along with the rice and now I'm moving on to my next ingredient today I'm going to be using beet root and beet is rich in antioxidant that will reduce wrinkles and fine lines brighten the skin clear pigmentation from the skin and it will also help to tighten and firm the skin now we are going to be peeling and chopping the beet since we're going to be blending the beet now you can also choose to use beetroot powder or you can use a fresh beet like I'm using here. Once the beet has been chopped, we're going to reach for our blender and we're going to add the beet to the blender along with the rice and the orange peel. So place it in the blender and now let's reach for some liquid. My liquid of choice is rose water and today I'm using about a half a cup of rose water. If you do not have rose water, you can go ahead, you can use just fresh water or you can even brew some green tea and use it in this recipe once this is done we are going to be blending and we are going to blend well after blending we are going to strain so reach for your small bowl and start straining all we need from this is the juice we're extracting the juice from the beetroot the rice the orange peel so press 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 and once that is done, here we have our liquid. Our liquid of rice, orange peel, and beet root. And now we're going to give this a stir since we're going to be adding other ingredients to this. This mixture can also be used as a standalone, as a facial toner, or mix it the way I'm showing here. My next ingredient is aloe vera gel. And we're using aloe vera gel for its antioxidant. We're using about a tablespoon of the aloe vera gel. Pour this in, and now we're gonna give it a star. Next, I'm gonna reach for some vegetable glycerine. I'm using the vegetable glycerine as a form of preservative. I'm using a tablespoon of the vegetable vegetable glycerin adding this to the bowl and now we're gonna start so here in our bowl we basically have rice orange peel rose water beet vegetable glycerin and also some aloe vera gel this complete our ingredient and now we are gonna pour our anti-aging facial serum in a small bottle so let's just pour this out you can make sure to use a sterilized bottle 
for this recipe a bottle with a pump is good something that you can pour from easily once this is done what i like to do i like to set this aside for about 24 hours for it to ferment we're fermenting that rice with that beet and orange peel this is going to make it so so much stronger and guess what guys after 24 hours your anti-aging facial serum is ready to use on the skin this you're going to use and clean skin so cleanse your face the way you normally do and then you're going to take a few drops three to four drops or so you're going to apply it on your skin preferably at night and you're going to massage it on the skin now in spite of the fact that this upbeat is not going to stain your skin it's going to leave your skin with a nice flush to it while reducing wrinkles and fine lines boots in the collagen production in the skin lighten and brighten tighten and firm the skin this is also going to leave your skin looking so much healthier because you use all that amazing antioxidant on your skin so massage it on the skin and it's good for the face the neck and the decollete you're going to massage this for about two to three minutes once this is done it's going to dry on the skin this is going to dry like in a couple of seconds you can choose to use a toner with this or you can just use without a toner choose to add a moisturizer on top of this or you can choose to just leave it as is now after that go to sleep with it and wake up with gorgeous looking skin use it every night and you're on your way to a more youthful natural glowing skin store it in the refrigerator and use it up within about seven days or so and there you have it a very simple recipe but a very effective remedy that you can use on the skin facial serum are normally rich in antioxidants and this one is also jump pack with skin brightening properties so if you have dark spots and blemishes on your skin definitely try this one if you're looking to lift tighten and firm the skin this one is for you. So thank you all for watching. You like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to leave your comments. And also don't forget to try the recipe. Thank you all and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.